Here I'm calibrating the E-Tape water level sensor. And the E-Tape is uh, this device. It's marked off in inches and centimeters. And um, when I pour the water in, it will give me a new voltage reading for the sensor. And that voltage reading goes into a Grove screw terminal, then into a um, bit maker, then microbit. Microbit then sends it on the serial port to data streamer and then Excel. And we'll um, calibrate it by adding various volumes. So um, we'll just start the process. And I'll add my first uh, water. So this is um, increments of uh, 705 millimeters. Now that everything is stable, I then go and take a measurement. And that has to be vertical. And uh, what I now do on the PC I press button A on the micro bit and it's now collecting 10 readings and providing an average and it will um, transmit the result to um, Windows. So it's now measuring the result and you can see the first reading has come in and we'll repeat that for this next increment. So we take our second bucket, fill it up, and then we try and stabilize everything. For a second reading. And we just simply press button A. It's taking 10 readings. And we'll have a look. And our second result has just come in. And we do that for another three increments. Take another 10 readings. and we get a new measurement. And at the end of all of that, we have a look at um, the results. I've got two more to go. And um, this is what it looks like. So we've um, plotted the uh, voltage against the volume and we get a straight line. And we can use that to determine the amount of water which is in the tank. And um, that concludes the calibration of the uh, E-tape sensor.